was on Amazon earlier, you know, just browsing around, you know, looking to see if there's anything on sale, PS4 games specifically, or any Evercade cards that I think I might be interested in. And I got recommended something that I thought would have been interesting to take a look at. Now, it's inside of this box here, okay? And it says, que onda, which means, what's good? Hey, what's up, Holmes? And so, I got this for $24, I believe. I can't remember. It's been already a couple of weeks and I still haven't did a video. Go figure. But uh, I thought it would have been cool if we took a quick look at it and, you know, see what the fuck this thing really is about. So, let's get started. Mm -hmm. How the hell do you start opening? Oh, okay. What? This big ass box for this tiny thing. What the fuck? And there's no bubble wrap in here, bro. What the fuck? So what we got here is the family pocket. As you can tell, it's one of those little generic devices that they sell at the remates, the swap meets, la pulga, whatever you want to call it. And, you know, the pictures on Amazon looked pretty interesting you know it's supposed to be a little tv that you can play you know 8-bit games pretty much shitty roms from nintendo and um it looked pretty cool i thought it would have been interesting little setup to have like in the future if i put a shelf back here i can have this running or something like that but i guess you could plug it into a tv also and you can play it so that's probably what we're gonna do as well just to see how these things work but i'm pretty sure these controllers are ass i mean what nes controller or <laughs> any nes controller had four buttons like that none okay so uh let's open it up and let's see what this thing looks like okay so there was no tape on it so we'll open it up <laughs> okay so first off this is it right here okay the dials do they work they i mean kind of oh shit i didn't expect it to turn on how do I turn up the volume? I guess that's the volume it's at. Oh no, like that. I mean, that's as high as it goes. The image is pretty, uh, it's pretty damn clear actually. I don't know if you guys can see it that well. Okay, I'm kind of surprised. I was expecting it to be worse, but I mean, all right, so let's see what else is in here because I'm really interested now. Okay, so it comes with this controller and you can hear it. It's supposed to have, it's supposed to have a fucking screw. It's supposed to have a screw. It didn't have a screw on it. What the fuck? Are they screwing me? Start, select, key, return to the game list. So I guess you put start and select to go back to the menu. Okay. Let's see, um, we have here is a little, a little note. Family pocket, bookshelf, retro TV. Bruh. <laughs> Thank you for your attention to Family Pocket Bookshelf Retro TV. You now buy this TV set that restore ancient ways, has the following functions and features. The ancient ways? What the fuck? Okay, so uh, it comes with this little fake antenna, I guess, to give it the aesthetic. You put it right here. With some pushing, you were able to get it in there. That looks pretty interesting though, that's pretty tight. So I assume this is what you use to charge it, and this right here is what you use to plug into the TV. Yeah, no HDMI, by the way. You're gonna have to use one of these, so, you know, get yourself a converter, because I'm pretty sure your fucking modern TV does not have this. Unless you have a CRT, then you're lucky, but come on, man. It has this fucking thing here in the corner, I don't know what that is. I don't know what the hell that is. I mean, it's not part of the screen. Like, I don't know, is that dust? Is that a dust bunny or something? I can't get it to move. How the f How do you get trash stuck inside the screen, bro? Like, that's, that should be against the law. All right, so now that I got batteries in here, the light is flashing, which means that it's ready to go. So let me get this camera set up in a good position so we can take a look at this uh, piece of, uh, I don't know what it is, this piece of crap. <laughs> so we can learn the ancient ways. All right, so here we are, ladies and gentlemen, taking a look at the Family Pocket Super, I don't know what the hell it's called, <laughs> but here we are taking a look at it. And this is the main menu. Now, 
It's not terrible. It's very generic, of course, but I mean, it's hard to kind of reflect on what I'm seeing with the little screen, but the screen is actually super clear and super colorful, which I'm super surprised, by the way, because I mean, this is like a generic <laughs> freaking like Chinese knockoff console with a bunch of shitty ROMs more than likely, right? So I mean, like, I'm actually surprised at how clear all this is coming in on my end. So, uh, you know, it looks pretty impressive on the camera. I'll give it that as well. So anyway, yeah, this is the main menu. As you can tell, there are six categories you have. Adventure, fighting, sports, puzzle, racing, <laughs> and shotting. <laughs> they couldn't spell shooting. I guess you can say it was like a space problem. But look how long adventure is spelled, okay? They could have added the O. More than likely, they didn't look over this crap. They just like, all right, do what you can and just send that bitch out. <laughs> all right, so uh, let's not waste any more time. and Let's get started with adventure. Let's see what they have here. All right, so we have 36 and 1, I guess. And uh, it says Super Mario Bros. Mario 6 and Mario 9. Very clever. Mario 69. Bro, what the hell? Who are these dirty ass motherfuckers working doing this shit? Okay, Mario 6. All right, that's a big story here, ladies and gentlemen. You heard it here first on Aries the Child. All right, that, uh, you know, what happened of 4 and 5? I have no idea, but it, that doesn't really matter because we have Mario 6 here. So what are we going to do? Take a look at it. Let's give it a try. All right, 1992. All right. And there's a title screen with no Mario, just Super Bros. <laughs> so it might not be Mario. All right, Super Bros 6. Oh my God, no. <laughs> what the f <laughs> It's Tiny Dudes. Come on, man. At least like put some effort into a shit. I'll go with Plucky, who cares, right? Oh my God, it's Mario. Fucking Mario. It's Mario with the... Do I throw fireballs? <laughs> no. So I'm just there just to just to bounce around, okay. It's Mario, ladies and gentlemen. This is wild. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my god. I mean, I didn't know what to expect, but I didn't expect Tiny Toons, you know what I mean? This is a fun game. Tiny Toons is a fun game, by the way, but Come on, man. It's Mario 6. <laughs> oh, I turned into Plucky. What the hell? Dude, so so Mario is the weakest form in this game, right? Because you always start off in any game. You start off like the least with, with like no power almost. And I just got hit and I didn't lose anything. So I guess Mario is just no longer exist in the game. <laughs> Mario, it was just Mario for that one little piece. I assume they try to go away around it by adding, I guess, a Mario character to a ROM so they can be like, oh, it's not the exact game. You know what I mean? But, yeah, Tiny Toons, man. This is a pretty, this is hilarious. I mean, I like I said, I didn't know what to expect. I was expecting s some sort of, like, ROM hack of a Mario game. But... <laughs> <laughs> this is just it. All right, so let's go down to Mario 9. Let's see what that is. Oh God, <laughs> it's fucking, it's Adventure Island. <laughs> Super Mario World, no way. <laughs> what the, f <laughs> the Super Mario World. <laughs> Mario is lost at sea and he must get back to the, what is it, Toadstool Kingdom. Okay. Yep, it's Mario. It's Mario on Adventure Island. I mean, I guess I would expect Mario to be here. Just considering, you know, how many other jobs and side hustles Mario actually has. Like, he's like one of the hardest working fucking video game characters of all time. Homie was a car dealer. What else was he? He was a... What else was he? He was a fucking uh, referee. He plays golf. Basketball. Like, this dude has no fucking shortage of hobbies bro or jobs you know that's a real hustler right there i'm a, i'm a hustler homie all right that's what the enough. hell is that this what the fuck is devil dom doom okay oh my god what is this what is this what the f 
<laughs> the poo straight up blasted me, bro. Look. I can't even move. You have like this fucking three second delay. Bro, what the fuck? <laughs> what, the what is this? Is this an actual game? Is this an actual game? Oh my god, you're screwed. There is not even music. I just wasted, uh, I wasted what? I wasted like one minute of your guys' time, and mine as well, so I apologize for that. <laughs> Angry Mario Nad, or now. <laughs> okay, what is this? <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, what the hell, dude? <laughs> what the? Dude, it's just like, it's gonna, oh, shit. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh crap. Oh crap. Ooh! <laughs> uh, the Goombas even look different. What the hell? They got like those fucking incredible masks on and shit. I'm not gonna get very- Oh man, I keep forgetting about that shit. Okay. I'm not gonna get very far. I'll tell you that right now. Ooh! Yeah! Jump! Ugh. Shoot. Ooh, ooh, shit. Oh, no! <laughs> Let's get out of here. What the hell, man? It's like, like, what is this full of small Mario? Mario Runner. Mario Circus. Bomber Mario Balloon Mario. What the hell? <laughs> this is nothing but Mario Rons? <laughs> What's Circus Mario? That's fucking interesting. Okay. Okay, I can't read that, but it looks familiar. I think this is Circus Charlie. Yep, it's Circus Charlie, but with Mario, of course. This game mostly reminds me of, I don't know if you guys uh, remember back in the day. This is probably like early 2000s or mid-2000s. Um, at the swap meets. Oh, shit. At the swap meets, they used to have like these... Uh, these little kind of consoles like this, these little Chinese knockoffs, right? And like they were super cheap plastic. And the controls always had like the N64 controller. And like you knew they were super cheap because like the joystick, I think the joystick didn't even work. The joystick was just like there just to make it look like a um, N64 controller. You always use the D-pad. But uh, I just remember this game being on there. This one, Contra, I think Bomberman was on there as well. And um, yeah, man, so like this game just reminds me of that. Obviously not this Mario one, but Circus Charlie reminds me of it. And <laughs> I keep hitting dying in the same spot. Street Fighter 6, whoa. What the hell? Let's, I gotta check it out. We just got to. Fighter. <laughs> Fighter Street 6, 12 peoples. <laughs> That's the name of the game. That's a mouthful. Like, oh, have you ever played Street Fighter? Nah, but I played Fighter Street 12, 12 Peoples. Or Fighter Street 6, 12 Peoples. You ever played that one? Like, oh yeah, it's pretty obsolete, man. You should check it out. It's a gem. Okay, so here we have Chun-Li, Ken, Gail, Blanca, E. Honda, and Ryu. All right, um, again, that's it. I guess they're just different colors. Pretty stupid, but okay, you know, I'm gonna go with the obvious. I'm gonna go with Blanca. Purple Blanca, boy. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get this shit going, Cuddy. We're about to whoop some ass. All right, birthday is 1966, okay. He's old or he's younger than Ryu. All right, come on. Come on, let's go. Let's do this. Whoa, whoa, right out the gates. Come on, come on. Let's do this, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? The controls are so bad, bro. You don't even know. What the fuck? Die! Die! Oh, he killed me. Oh, no! I almost had him. I almost had him, me. What the fuck? Okay, come on. Oh, man, dude, come on. Bro! I don't even know how to do the specials! Back up! Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Move, bro, back up. You're all up in my space. All up in my personal zone, Holmes. I'm in this way. I'm in this way. What's up, puto? Let's get spam this motherfucker. 
Oh shit! Get him! Get him! Oh no! He's gonna kill me one more! Oh, bro! This is a fucking rigged game. I had him! What the hell? So you see me here, folks, again. Another exclusive. We have Fighter Street 6. Alright, come on. Making love. Cue the Barry White music. Whatever, whatever, yeah, yeah, yeah. Girl. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, are you going to start any time? Stage three? What the fuck? Why is it changing like that? Whoa, what is this? This ain't making love. The f <laughs> These are fucking tanks. <laughs> I mean, there has to be something said here, right? I I'll tell you what it's supposed to say. It's supposed to mean make love, not war. Oh, jeez, okay. <laughs> it's so stupid. What the hell? I guess, uh, yeah, make love, not war. That's the analogy here. Um, also, you can say, Whoa! What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Sing it again. Whoa! Yeah, or you can say, you know, um, when a man and a woman love each other very much, the man must uh, find, get his tank and shoot his missile into his target and make little baby tanks. You know, that's another way of saying it. But this is making love. Uh, this is more like, uh, get out of my face. Uh, uh, that's right. Uh, can I turn it up more? Can I turn this up more? Of course not. Uh. Konami knew what's up, man. Konami knew how to make some fucking hits for their console. All right. I love I love when these people know how to sit behind the keyboard and start cooking. That's like the best part of any video game is the music, right? This shit's timeless. Uh, uh. Again with this fucking D-pad, dude. Like, I'm trying to go right. I'm trying to go down, and he keeps wanting to move back and forth. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Ooh. Yep, well, this is Turtles. I mean, there's not much of a difference. It looks good. It sounds good. Aside from it being a... I think it's a Japanese ROM. It's, you know, nothing wrong with it. The only thing I could say is a pain in the ass is these controls, you know. But I feel like I'm going to have this same problem with every game. So, you know, it's going to be an, that's going to be a common uh, complaint here. Spartan X. It's... What the... Same Spartan X, bro. What the fuck is this? Kung Fu or whatever? What is this game called? Oh, man, just a pass in the guess those ways. Okay, well, yeah, here's Spartan X right here. What's his name on 300? Um, Legolas? This is Sparta! Yep, that's it. Okay, of course, got my ass kicked. I got jumped by three dudes in the same clothes and one other dude just watching. Fantastic. Okay, so it's Indiana Jones. I never played this game before, but I don't know why it's in the sports section, so let's give it a try. Okay. Can we start today soon, please? Okay. Wait, why is it glitch like that? When I stand still, it don't show, but when I move, like, it does this little weird glitch. I don't know. Okay, so I guess I'm supposed to save these people? Are they kids, or are they, uh... Or are they just, like, freaking people being worked to fucking work in the mines and shit? That's pretty fucked up. All right, so, uh, swing. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. How do I swing? Oh, there you go. Nice. That's what I'm talking about, baby. All right, so we go in here. Okay. So I get a cut... So do so you get a cutscene every time you go in a tunnel or what? Okay. Well, that's kind of random, but, you know, it's doable, I guess. What does the arrow mean? Does the arrow mean like you gotta go back to where you came from? Or is that just a Karen thing? <laughs> hey, I had that one in the pocket, bro. I didn't even know. <laughs> All right. Um, uh, shit. Why can't I save that kid? What the fuck? That kid is screwed or what? All right. So we go into there. I'm not gonna lie, bro. This is pretty. Bo Whoa! What the hell? Every time you jump, 
you jump down for some reason. Look, if I jump, you go down. Why? What kind of sense does that make? What? Oh my god, yeah, fuck you, Indy. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, get, get out of here, dude. I'm gonna spend so much time on that shit, and it shouldn't even be in this section. It should have been in the adventure section. Come on. All right, I don't know what the hell. Okay, Technos. Oh, it's a cool little opening scene there, by the way. Oh, great. I can't fucking read that, dude. Uh, I can't read this. But I can already tell you, it's one of those games. I don't know, uh, what is the name of that company that does it? Not Technos. It said Technos, but um, they are the ones who did River City Ransom as well, right? Like, it's the same character designs and everything. I mean, I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. I don't know. Oh, it's me right there, but... Oh, shit! Whoa. Whoa. Whoa! Yeah, okay, that's enough. <laughs> I don't know what the hell I'm doing. All right, let's, let's go to Puzzle, baby. And I think that's... What the hell? That's like the little alligator from... Uh, what's that game? That game on the mobile. It's supposed to be like a, a knockoff. It's a Disney game. It's a knockoff of the of the alligator from, I think, Peter Pan. What's it called? Where's my water? Or where, what happened to my water or some shit? Okay, so... Um, okay, so we have Bubble Bobble Part 2, Snow Bros, okay, I've, I never played that by the way, so I might play that right now. So, Animal Contest, Arkanoid, Astro Robo Sasa, or Zaza, <laughs> what the fuck, Baloo Shoot, Baltron, Baltron, it's a last name actually, I think um, Sinaloan people have that last name, right, a lot of them do, is Baltron or Beltron, I can't remember. Data? That's what the little kids call their dad, right? That's how they say dad in, a, in Willow. They're like, Dada! Dada! Like, what's going on, children? All right, the farmer. Toy Story? We gotta check it out. Toy Story on the NES? Let's give it a shot. I was a huge fan of the Toy Story game on the SNES, even though it wasn't that good. Just something that's super nostalgic to me, okay? See here? There's no title screen, so we're in for a treat. Okay. Dude, this fucking Bomberman. This ain't Toy Story. What the hell? I mean, I should have known better. These fools are always capping on these little consoles and shit. And look at the character. It looks like it looks like it wants to be Mario, but then like I guess Toy Story because they want to make it look like Sheriff Woody. There's a snake in my boot. And what else does he say? Someone's poisoned the water hole. <laughs> You're my favorite deputy. <laughs> Boom! Take that, you bitch! <laughs> so that's Toy Story, man. Tetris? That's right, we gotta play some Tetris. Oh, God. <sighs> it's Tetris 2. It's Tetris 2. Let's try Pac-Man, right? Okay. It looks good, but does it look good? Yeah, Pac-Man, baby! I mean, with this D-pad, it's gonna be a fucking mission to do this, but, you know. Look at it! Ira! Ira! No manches, wey. Pinches control la de verga. Yeah, I mean... It's Pac-Man, right? Everybody loves Pac-Man. If you don't love Pac-Man, then, like, yeah. I don't know, man. I mean, Pac-Man must have fucking... I don't know, the arcade cabinet must have fell on your foot one day, or, like... I don't know, got possessed and then beat the shit out of you or something for you to hate Pac-Man. Because there's no reason why you should dislike Pac-Man. Um, <laughs> I said I was going to try out Snow Bros. Because that's one that I never played before. So, uh, I know. It's crazy, right? It's like, are you a real gamer? Like, uh, I don't know, man. Shit. You know, what is a real gamer? Does a real gamer play every game in existence? Because that would be very few people out there. I can't read that, obviously. Okay. Floor one. Okay, so you jump. And shoot. Okay, shoe balls. Okay. Shoot snow, I guess. Ha 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 ha. What do I push it? Oh, 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 oh. What do I do with it? The oh, fuck? Bro, you better back up off that shit, homie. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ha ha ha. Whoa. Me tiró hasta la chingada, no manches. Uh, 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 uh. Whoa. 
Oh, tight. Okay. I got used to it. All right. Nice. Nice. Okay. I, I think I got it. This is actually a pretty cool game. I, I don't know why. I, I don't know why I freaking uh, never played it before. I'm a little uh. Okay, shot me right in the ass. <laughs> I'm a little uh. I'm a little embarrassed that I never played it, man. This looks like a really fun game. I don't know what the hell was wrong with me. I mean, it, uh, but to be fair, it's one of those games that I feel like I wouldn't even played anyway, unless uh, unless I had a family member who had it back in the day, right? And, and and also, like, there's a lot of games that I didn't really play growing up because, you know, we just didn't have the money to do it and shit. So, um, you know, it's cool that I'm older now and I get to try out all these games because now I'm kind of like, hell yeah. Oh, get him, get him, get him. Ah, oh, damn it. I was trying to shoot him before he shot me. Okay, that was Snow Bro. That's pretty tight. If, if I don't move now, I'm going to spend hella time on that one. So, let's go to racing. Excite Mario Bros. You know what that means, right? We got to check it out. Yo, what the f What the hell? Look at Kirby up on top. Bye, Kirby. <laughs> what the fuck, yo? What is this? This ain't a racing game. What the hell? They got all this shit mixed up. Okay, so your Mario. Oh, what the fuck? I guess that's what they mean by Excite Bike or Excite Mario. There's a. F oh, look, Samus up on top. Pop out again. Oh, look at Samus. Dope. Okay, could I go in here? No. Uh, the controls feel a little floaty, so I'm gonna have to take my time. Come on. Oh, come on, man. I touched that shit. Hurry up. Okay, can I go in this one? Yeah. Boom. All right, now I'm back, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry about that. I had a phone call, and I had to attend to it. All right, so here we have it. Whoa! So these Excite Bike dudes are supposed to be like the Paratroopers, the Koopa Troopers, or whatever, right? Okay, I get it. And they're supposed to be Goombas as well, I guess. Whoa. Okay. What? Do I ever get a Fire Flower, bro? I want to get one of those. Shit. Like, when am I going to be able to blast these fools? What the? F what is that? Oh! It's chasing me! Oh! Oh, what the, what the hell? What the hell is this chicken nugget following me around for? What is that? Bro, there is no clear indication on what that is. If I pause it, maybe? It has no form. <laughs> what the fuck is that? What the hell, dude? It's just following me for no reason, and there's no reason for it. And another one. Aw, oh, come on, dude. I can't... Of course. They do it just to freaking mess with you. Oh shit, I'm running out of time. Let's go! Let's go! I guess the chicken nuggets don't come with me. What the hell is this game, bro? This shit is crazy. What is that right there? So, let's take a look at the last quarter category, and that is... Ta -ta 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 -ta. Shotting. Contra, 24 and 1. What the hell? What is that? Let's check it out. Oh, what the fuck is this? Contra 1, 2, FM gun, shotgun, Contra 30. What is this? I, what is this, like level 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7? Like, is there 24 levels in Contra? Let's try this middle one. I have no idea. Let's check it out. Okay, it's regular Contra. Mm. Is there anything? Stage 7! Okay, I guess they give you the stages here, but... <laughs> what the fuck? What? Why would they do that, bro? That's so stupid. What the hell? Oh, great. No, I can't. Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! I'm out of here, bro! Ha ha ha! No! Oh, shit. Yeah! Ha 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 ha! Ha ha ha! Take that! Whoa, 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 bro, I forgot about this fool, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, get one of this boy, ah, oh, bro, I forgot about that shit too, <laughs> Mario in Space, made by what, www.touchgamerplayer.com, <laughs> sounds a little freaky to me, but you know, we're gonna check it out anyway, alright, see, this goes to show you that Mario is a hustler, 
All right, this fool has been every single character, has done every single job almost. You know what I mean? Just like fucking Barbie herself. All right, you know Barbie's a doctor. That bitch is a dentist. She's a fucking a vet. She works at stores. She shops. Like she does everything, bro. And Mario's just kind of like, nah, B. All right, like you, you over here making it seem like men can only do one type of work and shit. Like, nah, nah, nah. La verga, aquí tenemos, güey. Aquí estamos trabajando. Echando no ganas, güey. Shit, you think Mario's playing around, bro? Hell nah. I forgot that fucking uh. You got that hustler spirit. Uh, the only thing we just haven't seen yet is uh, Mario fucking, um, you know, like, sell any butter or anything like that, you know what I mean? I can I can imagine Mario selling a dub sack and shit like that, you know what I mean? Start stacking up his chips and shit, start getting into the, you know, into the street corner, start selling a little something, something, you know what I mean? That's the only thing we just need to see Mario win. I don't think Barbie has done that, all right? I don't think, I don't think Barbie has went into the dark corners of civilization. You know, and started doing shit like that. Mario might, Mario might have to be the first one. All right, but this is Mario in space. You know, jokes aside, and it's a pretty fun game. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> back up, bro! Shit, trying to get me, homie. Oh, he did get me. <laughs> what the fuck? I like Fantasy Zone. It's a, it's a fun game, not a pretty fun game. I actually have fun with this one. I think I played the Turbo Graphics version before. I don't think I played this one. This is, I mean, I may be wrong most of the time I am, but I think this is the uh, Master System um, version, right? Like I said, I could be wrong. Oh my God, dude, these D-pads are fucking kicking my ass. Ugh. Ha ha ha. Yeah, of course. I can't even go right. I can't even go right without going down or up or back. Jeez, man. I mean, for 20 bucks, what do I expect, right? But I expect this some. Like, the controls, like, it's one thing when the rock... <laughs> Fucking asshole. Whatever. Summer Carnival 92, baby. Let's see what that is. Next, Naxat Soft. Ooh, looks like a novella. Official. Rebecca? Or Rekka? <laughs> what the fuck? Rebecca? I don't know why he said that. Okay. Summer Carnival 92, and I don't know what that is, but it looks like some graffiti, and it looks hard. All right, those colors look nice, though. I would like to know what that says. Okay, so let's give it a try. Ooh, this ain't summer. This ain't the carnival, but it's a space shooter, so let's give it a try. Oh, dude. Oh, shit. <laughs> this is the shit. Oh, dude, this is amazing. I'm not even lying. Look how fast paced this is. This is definitely like was made way after the NES was made. This is something that somebody created, you know, as a passion project. Cause right? It has to be. Someone let me know at the comments at the bottom, man. Cause this ain't no way that this is a real thing. This is pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie. I'm actually really surprised at how fucking awesome this game is. But the the problem that I have, again, is the controls, dude. Like like, how can I play this game? Please, somebody, let me know what the name of this game is called and how I can actually play it. Because I really want to play with the better controller. This is amazing. This is dope as hell. I'm like, I'm over here battling the controller and the freaking game at the same time. It shouldn't be like this. It shouldn't. Oh, man. But, yeah. Not to waste any more time. We already kind of went way over with this shit. So, um, yep, that was the Family Pocket. So that was the Family Pocket, fam. <laughs> I can't begin to tell you how terrible this is. I was laughing and all that shit because it's very entertaining. But uh, is it worth buying for over $20? Not really. For a decoration piece, yeah. It's 20, you know, especially if it was something just to try out because I was very curious. Like I said, when I saw the picture, I was like, no way that there's like a screen that actually plays games. It does play, but it doesn't play very well. And as you can see, there's a bunch of bad um, ROMs in there. And it just it just shows. And the main culprit, though, the main culprit of all this is this thing. OK, this controller is so bad, especially the D-pad. The buttons are one thing, but the D-pad, dude. If you try to go back or forward, you see how it pushes down. Let me see. You see how it pushes down the side buttons. 
So if you try to go back, you're pushing up and down at the same time. So you're left there kind of, you know, you're kind of stuck, you know, as a character. And it's kind of like, well, okay, what's the point? I mean, I doubt you can find another controller there's nowhere else you can plug it you can't bluetooth connect it or anything so i mean i'm kind of screwed <laughs> i'm kind of stuck with this controller but it's not like i'm gonna play it it's not like i'm gonna sit here and play it all the time so you can say i threw away i think 25 dollars you know it is what it is i mainly wanted it like i said just to put here when i make a shelf and put it back here run the games you know a little for a little bit of aesthetic that's kind of what I really wanted it for. But, you know, I thought it would have been a cool video to check out just to see what it's all about and kind of make fun of how stupid some of these things are. <laughs> so that was a family pocket on this episode of Unbox and Pickups. Let me know what you guys think at the bottom, man. Would you buy this? Are you interested in any of this crap? Because I'll tell you right now, please don't waste your money and don't blame me if you get it, all right? Because uh, I'm telling you to stay away. But if you like that kind of aesthetic, if it'll be cool, get it you know it's a nice little background piece you know something like that but um let me know what you guys think at the bottom man um question what is y'all's favorite nes game i'm not very familiar with the nes library that's something i've been really wanting to get into and it's a series i'm planning on doing on trying out different games from different consoles just because i didn't really grow up with many so let me know what you guys think at the bottom and um if you haven't yet don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel ladies and gentlemen i'd very very much appreciate it so uh until next time fam i will catch y'all in the next one deuce